before I get started, I'll put on some, some of this gloves in a bottle, which is wonderful stuff. Keeps my hands safe from any chemical that might be going on. I'm liking some things that are happening. And that is a very good way to express what I think makes good painting. And that is that things begin to happen on the canvas that I did not plan. Let me say that the other way around. If the only thing that happens on your canvas are things that you foresaw and planned, predicted and executed, you have a boring canvas. Does that make sense? Because none of us are clever enough, sharp enough, creative enough, witty enough, visually, whatever, enough to create a painting, stroke, brush hair by brush hair, that is more interesting than, than the spontaneous accidents that happen in the course of producing a painting. In the art world, that's what we call dropping your paper. I was about to switch to, uh, I want to get the uh, ankle of this horse right anyway. So you want things to happen on the canvas that you did not expect. Let me use some, again, some different words to try to de describe that same process. The child in you, and I know this sounds kind of hokey and psycho babblish and so forth, but stay with me for a moment. If the child, if your inner child is not getting a little buzz out of what you're creating, then you're probably not creating anything particularly good. While I'm going along every once in a while, the little, and I've managed to keep it in most of the time during this painting, but the little child in me goes, wee! <laughs> it, please understand, it is very undignified. I am not a serious artist. I'm a good artist. <laughs> and good artists all have this in common, that the child in them still goes, whoopee, when something fun happens on the canvas, okay? Whew, I probably just got myself in a lot of trouble, but I'm going to stand by that. Bad artists are the ones that are able to plan every stroke, everything they're going to do. In fact, it's funny, a lot of people will come up to me when I'm nearly finished a painting, and they'll say something like, oh, and to think you had all of that in your mind before you started. And honestly, I, I promise, I'm usually very nice about it. And I just smile and say, yeah. <laughs> I'm not so nice on the inside, you could tell, because I'm laughing at them. On the inside, I'm going, you idiot. <laughs> oh, I'm so nasty. But on the, uh, on the inside, I'm going, are you kidding? I made this up as I went along. And I'm a, I'm a f f firm uh, proponent of making it up as you go along. Now, I should qualify that just a little bit. There are many times that I do artwork that is more precise and more planned out than this. But even in that more precise planned out artwork, there's room for happy little accidents. <laughs> 